Hey everybody. Um, I just wanted to tell everybody thank you again um, for praying, for sending me encouraging words. Um, it's been a long journey, in 11 years. And um, yeah, I get tired, you know, just like anybody else would get tired. I'm not exempt from getting tired. Um, but my faith is still strong, so I just want to get this other eye done, and hopefully that will, um, help alleviate some of the pressure and triggering migraines all the time, like I'm having one now. <laughs> And I'm going to take this medicine, turn these lights off, and try to get some sleep. I hadn't been sleeping very well lately because I have this thing on. You know, when you're not used to sleeping with anything on, and then my eye, you know, when, when it begins to heal, it starts itching. And I can't touch it, so. So, um, so I just... I'm just ready to get my other eye done and get this over with and so I can be ready to celebrate my birthday next month. You know, because every year for the for about seven years now, um, every time my birthday come around I have to wait to celebrate my birthday because I'm normally recovering from a major surgery or something. Or oh, I've had back-to-back -back surgeries or something like that. So, um, this will be the first time that um, I'm not recovering from a major surgery. And that's why it's so important that I go ahead and get my other eye done this Wednesday. I've been posting videos. I hope you guys are watching the videos and and considering what I'm asking for on the videos. So um but in the meantime um I'm stuck in the house. <laughs> um Well, I don't mind because I know it's necessary for me to heal properly. Um, particularly after I, I, my body have gone through so many surgeries within the last seven years. And not just like fix a broke arm. I mean like brain surgeries. And, uh, so... strokes and radiation and more surgeries you know I'm just thankful that that I am still here to give my testimony and to show that God is still gracious he's still merciful and even in the midst of your most difficult times you got to know he's there with you and for you Um, like I said, I was just wanting to say something to you, to my followers, and it's raining, um, like I said, I'm going to take this medicine and try to get some sleep, I haven't been sleeping well, but tonight I hope I sleep well, sleep better than I have been, um, and those of you that haven't seen my videos, you know I'm doing a part two of Say My Sight campaign. You guys came through in the clutch for me on my left, my right eye. My right eye is my dominant eye. So, that was an easy one. So, my left eye is much more, much, much, much more damaged. Um, so... So what's happening now, because this eye is healing, I, I can't make alerters and stuff, but 
the the colors are crisp. And then over here, it's just like a beige off white. Everything is beige off white, you know, on this side. So, um, to get this side done next Wednesday, it's going to be $2,600. And I've been talking about it. You all have seen my videos and stuff floating around. I just made some more videos yesterday and today. You've seen them floating around. Um, and like I said before, never be afraid or ashamed to ask for help. Particularly in a situation like this. Not something I foreseen coming. Something completely out of my control. You know. So, yeah. Um, I, I'm asking for help. So, that's just what it is. Um... Like I said, I gotta raise twenty. I gotta have twenty six hundred by Tuesday, because you pay the day before the surgery. By Tuesday, I gotta have twenty six hundred dollars, and to some that's a lot of money, but to some it's not a lot of money. Um, so, um, my cash app is Benita Wrights. I mean, dollar sign, Benita Rice, and that's dollar sign, B-E-N-I-T-A-W-R-I-T-E-S. And then my Zelle is Benita Rice at Yahoo.com. Um, again, it's B-E-N-I-T-A-W-R-I-E, I'm sorry, B-E-N-I-T-A-W-R-I-T-E-S. At yahoo.com. That's my sale. Um, like I said, one person might give the whole thing. I don't know. I, I just believe God. When I went walked in the surgery center last Wednesday, I didn't have all the money. My children went with me. They'll t well, they had to go. They'll tell you. I signed in and sat down <laughs> like I had everything I needed, knowing I didn't have all the money I needed for the surgery. But I sat down and waited, and um, I sat there, and I told the lady, give me, give me a few minutes. And um, I just sat there and prayed, and probably 15 minutes went by. And um, my daughter and my son and myself, between the three of us, we, we, pulled, we came up with the rest of the money so I could have the surgery. So... And I know if God did it, then he'll, he'll do it again. He'll do it again. So, um, and I know sowing into me, into my life, I'm good ground because I've always sown. I've always been a tither. I've always been a worker. I've always been a helper. You know, so I've always been a server. So, um... I expect for this to happen, you know, for me. Um, because I've made things happen for other people. You know, I've given away cars with the title, everything. I'm talking about working cars, not something somebody had to go fix. Um, we've housed people, everything. You name it, I've done it. Clothed people, fed people. Uh, went to court, stood by people. So, now it's my turn to need help. And I had to fight my own self to, to ask for help. So, again, I need $2,600. I got to have that by Tuesday. All right. I'm going to post my information with this video. I'm going to lay down. My head's hurting and I'm tired. All right. You guys keep me in your prayers. And um, I'll be seeing you soon in my studio once we get this other eye fixed, okay? All right, good night.